Welcome to the Sharon Valentine Internet TV Show. How would you like to learn how to use your own internal guidance to create your ideal life experience? Sharon is an author, parent, and life coach who teaches and inspires people from all walks of life. She draws on her extensive study of the universal law of attraction to guide her clients in attracting what they desire to manifest. Her motto is, you are the most powerful person in your life. Here is your host, life coach, Sharon Valentine. It's a cottage industry for you right now, right? Industry yes. portage, a cottage industry, and you want to keep, I'm hearing that you want to have control over it, maintain control, and keep the quality, keep them special rather than have it be, you know, mass consumerism, you know, massive quantities, Absolutely. where Absolutely. you tend to lose the quality many of the time, much I, of the time. I, you know, I, I'm sure there are many companies out there that don't want to lose the soul of their company. I mean, there's, there's there's the brand and you know typically a brand uh, is a reflection of the the people or the person that that has a vision definitely that, you know yeah. and so uh, I'm interested in growing that brand and establishing that brand and and even rethinking it sometimes I mean I, I've taken some oh, sure. different some little I've made some small adjustments over the last few years as I developed this because um, just the just the things that I'm interested in. But isn't that half the fun is, is. You know, when great. you have your own baby, you know, you get to create it. And, you know, our lives and our businesses are always in evolution. You know, we're always in process with them. So I think half the fun is getting that inspired idea on what change you want to make next. Right. Because if something stay, stays stagnant or gets stagnant, it, it's not any fun anymore. Right. And I imagine you really want to keep this fun. Yes. Absolutely. Well, I love your branding. I went to your website and, you know, it's a beautiful site. You know, you can clearly see all of the bags, the colors, just the whole theme and branding looks great. So I was suitably impressed and I would encourage anyone to go and, and, and check out your site. Great. Thank you. Yeah, I appreciate that. What is the one thing you want people to know about your bags? Just the one thing to inspire them to you know, take a look at what you have to offer. The one thing that I would want people to know is that I stand by them 1,000%. And so uh, I, I've dealt with some customers that weren't happy with for one reason or another. And uh, fortunately, almost everybody has been. But I, I have dealt with some customers that haven't been entirely happy with a bag for whatever reason. It didn't work for them. Mm -hmm. And... I started Industry Portage because I was that person on the other end at one point, and uh, and in fact one of those people, uh, one of the one of my customers who I, I kept sending them different uh, models of bags, trying to get them to buy one of them, and uh, and it didn't work for them. And it was an architect in in New Jersey, and we're now designing a bag together, and um, and that's something that's going to be coming up, and that that's. I, you know, I, I don't know if that really tells anybody about what how I feel about the bags, but it's important to me that it works for them. Yes. 100%. And everybody's uh -huh. happy. And what a cool thing that he's going to be designing the bag with you because That's then, fine. you know, you'll learn something, you'll, you know, and he'll get the exact bag that he's been wanting, right? <laughs> That's right. Well, so that, I that's really important. Yeah, I, actually, uh, her her name, her, uh, she her name is Jamie, and and we're gonna be uh, we're still prototyping the bag uh, at this point, and um, it's something that we're hoping to launch by the end of this year. We're hoping to launch it by the end of last year, but um, we've been making some design changes, and as it goes, right, uh, things cool. Will uh, a woman's <laughs> influence. So, are your bags mostly? Which brings up a good point. Are they mostly masculine? I want to say they're unisex. Okay. Yeah. All right. I mean, the 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 basic the you know in terms of demographics, the typical customer I want to say is seventy by seventy five percent male. Um, but okay. There are there are women who uh, use the bags, especially the um, um, like w the cargo bag, which is a a bag sure. of uh, yeah. one of my designs, which is very it's very unisex. I mean, I, I use it for. You know, when I go sailing, I used it when my kids were in diapers. I used it as a diaper bag, and so you know, there were a lot of women that that uh, bought that bag because. Well, when I looked online and I checked out every bag, I could see myself using you know any number of the bags. Great. So that's the beauty is that they can be unisex, which is important. But